Get you one, Keon. Get you one, Keon. Okay, Keon. Huh? Get there. Up. On his head. Good D, Marty. Pass, Marty. Baby Zion right there, dog. Baby Zion. Baby Zion. Lockdown field. The rebound, Jaha. Lockdown field. Oh, ho, oh, lockdown, ho, oh, up, lockdown. Lockdown field, get it right back. Get it right back. Get it right back, lockdown field. Oh, okay, okay, lockdown field. Get you one, Marty. Uh. Lockdown field. Lockdown field. Lockdown field. Get him. Lockdown field. Lockdown field. Lockdown field. Uh, 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 uh. Good rebound.
Hello. Hey, Marty. Ah ah Good be Marty. Lockdown field. Lockdown field. Lockdown 
Brasil. Uou, 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 uou. <risos> Lockdown field! Lockdown field, dog! Lockdown field! I'm gonna get me one, I don't care. on Who's Mizzou Network, who I have here? Ryan Blakey, Black 2021. Speak about, you know, having to, you know, regroup, get y'all mind right. Y'all want to 
tough, close game against HD last night in overtime. So just speak about, you know, how y'all prepared yourself for the day. Man, we went in an OT with HD. It was a tough game. But other than that, we came here with a different mindset, come out, try to destroy him, and then, yeah, got the dub. Got you. Speak about your third quarter in that second half. You know, that third quarter defensive pressure. Like, you led your team in the third quarter. You led your team in points tonight, too. So just speak about your third quarter play. I try to get everybody involved, and then defense, coach say, who got Kool-Aid in their stomach? But everybody, we got everything in us, and we got hope that we just get the dub. Got you. Do you feel as though this is a statement one for you all? Yes. 11-0, baby. 11 and 0. Got you. Who next on the schedule? Uh, we go to Salisbury for the Governor's Challenge, so we hope to play Archbishop Curley the first game, so we hope to get that dub there. Got you. One thing you got to let the DCAA, DCAA know about the Rough Riders? Man, we coming. Got you. One time before we get up out of here, could you shout out Who's Mizzou Network? Shout out Who's Mizzou Network. Bet. We live on Who's Mizzou Network. Who I have here? Rob Niggas, head boys basketball coach Taylor Roosevelt High School. Got you. Coach Rob, how did you get your boys to regroup and, and get focused? Because I heard y'all had a tough one yesterday at the Melk House against HD. So how you get them to like stay focused and prepare for the day? You know what's crazy, though? This is a young team, and it's going to be nice where the energy level is not there, but still encourage these guys that we gonna win and that's tough when you got a young group but um today we just said we wanted to bounce back this morning you know out here in this showcase of north point against a great win park team i thought the energy level in the second half was deep you can see it so i'm happy with the effort hey i'm glad we got a week off before next weekend gotcha. that's we very important very important because we've played so many games in the first 19 days in the season, so I'm just looking forward to the rest and getting back to work, man, in the new year, man. But um, going out to the Governor's Challenge next week, it's not going to get easy. Everybody's coming for us right now, so we got to be ready to play. Got you. Speaking of the second half, the third quarter was basically the difference. Speak about your team, third quarter defensive pressure. Well, the halftime speech was, man, we're not playing with energy. You know, we, we, I don't know if it came from us getting up early this morning after playing and getting home at 11 o'clock last night. You know, we never make excuses at the Milk House, but the energy level wasn't there. And I just challenged him, man. I'm like, hey, if we can go, we can run Sunday to Kings Dominion if you want to. And um, I thought that put a little fire on him. Because um, I told him I was going to give him a day off, which was tomorrow. And the energy level picked up, so I'm happy with that. But like I said, man, it's a long road. You're talking about playing pretty much, what, 12, 13 games in, what, 18 days? Basically. It can catch you. <laughs> it can yeah. catch you like the Grand Reaper, but I'm happy with the win. Got you, yeah. Good luck. Congratulations on the victory tonight, Coach. One time before we get up out of here, just shout out the network. Who's Mizzou Network, man? Fonz or Ducky, you know how we do it. Milk House basketball. Yeah. We live on Who's Mizzou Network. Who I have here? Uh, Marty Lee Kane, combo guard, class of 2020. Got you, Marty. Just speak about your play, you know, coming off the bench, giving your team that spark. You had 14 points off the bench. You shot 50% from the field. So just speak about your play. Um, Rob just told me, you know, although I'm coming off the bench, everybody eventually gets that opportunity to play on the floor. And when you get that opportunity, you got to be ready. So, and um, I wanted to be ready, but I wanted to play my game and be comfortable too. Um, and just go in there, go in there and like bring what I can, bring my skill set to the team. Got you. You was very efficient. You was very efficient. Um, yes, I, I'm, I'm glad you said speak about being ready because you didn't play in the third quarter at all. But in that fourth quarter, once you got in, boom, spot, quick eight points. You know what I mean? So, like, just speak about, you know, staying ready and staying prepared, being locked in, you know, once your name called, just coming in and, you, like you said, bringing your skill set to your team. Like, honestly, like, coming off the bench, it's like you get to observe the game. You get to observe the tempo, the flow, the energy, um, the right and the wrongs of what's going on and stuff. And... Um, like I said, when you get that opportunity, you get in the game, then that's your chance to change it. So uh, that fourth quarter, I definitely like was, I felt like I was fired up by the fact that, you know, we had momentum going and then and Coach Rob was like, we could push ourselves even a little harder and stuff. So that was like, yeah, I, I, that, that, had, that had my mind. Like, and I was in the mindset of, oh yeah, I'm gonna go out there and be ready to play. And um, on the offense and defense, do what I gotta do. You know, got you, so. got you. Great game tonight, man, and great way to be ready, man. When you when they call you, just be ready. Uh, congratulations on the win. One time before we get up out of here, you already know what it is. Shout out Who's Mizzou Network. Yeah, we live on Who's Mizzou Network. Who I have here? 
Marcel Gabriel, forward, center, class of 2020. Gotcha. What was the game plan going against a tough Gwen Park team today? Um, game plan was to keep pressure on them. We know they got some good players, some good three-ball shooters, some good rebounders. Kept the energy level up in the second half. The first half was a little slow. Um, went in the locker room, talked to each other, trusted each other. Went out there, we made a play. Gotcha. Speaking of the second half, your third quarter, you was one of the key factors in that third quarter that you know made that run for y'all. So just speak about you know your play and your team play in the third quarter. Yeah, um, I was uh, I was real slow in the first half. Um, I told myself and I told my teammates I got to pick it up for us to keep this going. And, you know, I, I picked it up. I bought the energy level. I bought defense, blocking, rebounding. So, you know, it was a great win for the team. Got you. Me. Got you. You had a double-double, 12 points, 12 rebounds, and you had about five blocks. So, and you got MVP. So, just how, how that feel? You got MVP uh, today, too. It's, it's, it's great. I, I get this MVP to our team because without them, I, went, I really wouldn't have had it. They got me going. They got my confidence back up in the first half. First half, I was hanging my head. Just down on myself, and then they just told me, pick it up, you got it. Got gotcha. you. Let, let the people see the hardware. Let the people see the hardware. <laughs> One time before we get up out of here, just shout out the network, man. Shout out to Zoo Network. Yeah. <laughs> we live on Who's Who's Network. Who we have here? Lockdown Field, Class 2022. Just call me a Congo Got gotcha. you, Phil. Man, once again, you come off the bench with the energy, man. You know you had eight steals tonight? I, I knew that. You come off the bench, 11 points, eight steals. Just speak about your energy and your play, man. I'm looking for my man. I just play how I play. I don't care. I just play. Got you. Speak about your team third quarter, man. That third quarter was very impressive. That's when y'all went on y'all yeah. runners and, you know, separated yourself from them. So, like, speak about the third quarter. For the third quarter, we just, we just, like, I don't know. Just turned it up. Yeah, we just, yeah, we just turned it up on them. Got you once again, man. You impressed me tonight. You everywhere on the court, man. You, you, we, you, we, you, you need someone like you on your team, man. Person that's just gonna play, strap up, pass. You know, feisty, scrappy, man. I love it, man. Keep playing just like that, all right? Yes, that's your role. You know that, right? Yes, sir. That's your role. What's your name again? Lockdown Phil. Yeah. Lockdown.